Are you tired of seeing all those videos that say make a million dollars, make $10,000 a week? I'm not saying they're not legit, but I'm saying some of those get your hope up and they get you excited. And a lot of people jump in and they buy all these expensive courses and all these expensive software and they don't have the skills to do what it takes to make that $10 million or that $10,000. So we're not talking about that today. We're talking about, are you looking to put some, you know, a few extra dollars in your pocket? Are you looking for a little side hustle to make some extra money? Um, that's not going to cost you a lot or maybe nothing. Okay. So that's what I'm going to show you today. Five different ways that you can really honestly and truly make money and you don't have to have the website, the funnel, and the, all that stuff. Now, th those things are great. That's building a business. But today we're talking about just looking for a side hustle, just to make some few extra dollars. And a couple of these I've done. I mean, all my life I have worked more than one job. I have always had a minimum of two, if not three or four. And I mean things like um, I've always done crafts to earn money. I've, I've gone on uh, eBay and... Uh, now I do Facebook marketplace and stuff like that. I just, I'm always looking for ways to bring in money and there's always side benefits. Um, and we'll go over those as well, but here's one that I have never heard of. I'm going to go over five different ways. And this is a company called swagbucks.com and you can get paid to take surveys. Now, come on. If you get an app, it looks like you can do it on your phone. You're sitting in the doctor's office, sit there and, and do a survey. When my kids were little, I would have jumped on this. I don't know how many ball games I had to sit at or how many swim meets I went to. And I loved it, but there's a lot of downtime, a lot of time that you're just sitting there waiting for the event to start. The kids are busy and you're sitting there all by yourself. I would have sat there and done surveys if I've known about it. Um, so you can go in, sign up. There's a $5 sign on bonus and you get paid to take surveys. How cool is that? Now the same site, we're going to count this as number one, not two, but on the same site, swagbucks.com you can also earn free gift cards and cash for everyday things you do online so you can earn points for um, answering surveys and you can shop and watch different videos and things like that so check out the site called swagbucks.com and it looks like there's several different ways you can make money or earn gift cards i'll take a gift card to walmart or amazon any day um so or it looks like you can put it in your paypal account <laughs> but go in there and see like i said making money on the go during those down times when you're waiting and waiting and waiting now, instead of sitting there and gossiping with some friends, you can be sitting there filling out surveys and making money. So number one, swag bucks or take surveys online. Let's look at number two. Now this one, you probably have to do a little bit more work. It's freelancing and freelancing fiverr.com. I, I know I've showed this before, but I can't stress enough. I've got friends that, um, one friend, her daughter is a graphic designer and she just hasn't been able, she's gotten out of college and she just hasn't been able to get a job. And I said, go to fiverr.com. Oh no, I can't do that. Now I'm only going to get paid five or $10. So what you start out doing that. So if you can make logos or you have a knack for doing those, um, Facebook banners, some people don't know how to do all that stuff. They have no idea and they don't even know how to begin to learn, uh, on the YouTube channel. There's just that little banner there. If you know how to do that, you can knock them out like this. Um, you can make uh, covers for people's PDFs that they make. You can make covers for eBooks. I had done, I did a whole funnel and I had some different eBooks and things in it. And I found this uh, couple that did it. They were out of, I don't remember, India. And they charged me $10 per cover and they were amazing. I, the, I was so pleased with the work, I gave them a tip. So my point is, you come in, you start charging a little bit, and once you get a lot of feedback, you get all those little stars, and people love you, then you can start up in your price. Or maybe you can say, for the first two or three, this is what I'll charge, and after that I charge more. I mean, unbelievable, you know, what you can do. Here's a, a lady that will uh, be a Pinterest marketing virtual assistant for you. If you'd like to do social media, you can come on here and find a job that you'd love to do and get paid for it. So if you love to post on social media, maybe you'd love to post on Instagram, find somebody out there that needs to hire somebody to post for them. Um, it's crazy, but you can get paid to do things that you love to do. So freelancing is number two. And I have a link below for this one. I'll put the swag um swag bucks down there too so for each of these i'll just go ahead and put all the links the next one i actually had looked into this at one time but i did not do it it's called vi 
VIP Kids. And basically, it's teaching children in other countries how to speak English. And it's mostly children from China. And you, you set up... Um, you have to get hired and then they give you all the training materials and you only teach for 30 minutes. The catcher, the, the catch in this is though, you have to teach from like eight o'clock at night till eight o'clock in the morning because they're on the other side of the world and time zone differences. Uh, I had actually went through the whole process and almost got hired and then I backed out because I thought I can't, um, I just didn't want to, I have a satellite at my house and I was just afraid I'd have trouble um, clicking in and stuff like that. So I didn't end up doing it, but I do have two or three friends that do it and they do it as a side hustle. It's not their main form of income, but they do it on the side and they absolutely love it. So you can make up to $2,000 a month teaching children from China how to speak English. And you might say, well, I don't know how to do that. They teach you. They have everything laid out for you. It's an amazing company. And here's another way you can make money. If you refer your friends, my link is not an affiliate link. I'm just going to tell you that. Um, if you refer friends, you can earn at the time that I saw it last time was like $50 for each person that you refer if they sign up. So I'll give you the link, um, but I'm not teaching with them and I'm not signing people up for $50. So um, just look, check it out. It's a neat way um, that, get, that you can make money. All right, the next one I have, sell your stuff. This one I have done. <laughs> this one you can go to Facebook Marketplace and sell your stuff. You can just click this little button, sell something. Anybody can do this. It's amazing. Now, when I first started selling online, I sold with eBay about, I'm going to say 16 years ago, I had moved and I moved to a new house and I had myself and my two daughters. And after we bought the house, I didn't have any money to fix the house up. It needed some updating. So I started looking around going, look at all the stuff that I have. Actually, I had long burger baskets. Um, back when eBay was brand new, they went for a mint. I made, I think I sold like $6,000 worth of stuff out of my house. And, and like I said, a lot of it was baskets and things like that. But then I started going, I love to go to auctions and I love to go to yard sales. And just because I was on eBay a lot, I knew the types of stuff that would sell. So we, I literally would go buy stuff for, from like Pottery Barn or something like that, or kids clothes that I knew would sell. And I turn around and sell them. And I was, I was bringing in as a single mom, and I had a part-time job, my job with eBay, I was bringing in $2,000 a month selling stuff on eBay. Now, I did go a little further and I went out and searched for things, but if you're just trying to get rid of things in the house, go through your house and sell them. You can also go to Craigslist. Um, that's another way to sell. Um, and then now there's Facebook Marketplace. I think Facebook Marketplace is starting to be the most popular way because everybody has it right there on their phone and it's just easy. So definitely if you're looking to make some money start selling stuff that's in your house especially if you're not that you're a hoarder but maybe you don't like to get rid of things um you just don't take the time start going through one room at a time and i bet you can make yourself some money side hustle not a, not a full-time income and what do we have next this one i don't think enough people think about if you're really good at taking pictures I, I see amateurs all the time that they some people just have a knack for taking really good pictures it's all about the angle and the lighting and they do it with their iPhone and you can make money selling your pictures to different companies now listen closely there are stock photo companies that will buy your pictures or they'll let you place them on there um, and here's three of them I'm going to give you one is called one two three RF I'll list it all down below 500 px or crest stock and what you do is they will put their they have a website where other people will come and say hey i want to purchase some of these pictures i want to have the rights to them and be able to use them and you get a commission off of that and all you're doing is something you love to do anyway this little girl is, pro is somebody's daughter and somebody that loved to take pictures and you can't even see her face beautiful picture and they get paid for that now you this one i did not know about as i was researching this for you which i did know about you can also make money taking pictures with your phone there's a phone app and they do the same thing but it's with phone and here's one it's a site called i m so it's e y e 
E-M.com. Again, I'll put it down below and they will pay you to take pictures with your phone. And there's an app that you can get and download it and you just do it all on your phone. So if you don't have a laptop and you don't like messing with all that, I know some younger kids just like to do everything on their phone. You can make money on your phone taking pictures. So here you are taking a walk with some friends. Click, click, click. You're just taking pictures because you have a knack for taking good pictures. And before you know it, you're downloading them and making money just living your life now how awesome is that so the other one that i found was called foap.com um, same thing it's another app you're gonna have to do some research find out which one works best for you but just knowing that that exists i got excited about that one all right so that's it five different ways that you can make money side hustle don't have to put any money out and do something that you love doing. And most of them are easy enough to do in the cracks of your day, throughout the day, instead of playing video games or watching a movie or spending time doing unproductive things, you can sit there and make money. Now, how awesome is that? All right. Thumbs up if this was helpful. I was excited about this. I hope some of you were too. Tell me your favorite way that you think you would like to earn some money, a side hustle job. I got a couple of videos up there that'll help you as well. Um, go ahead and check those out and check out my channel. I am here to help you earn money, save time, and find balance in your life. I'll see you on the next video.